challenged us to take action, to stop the obstructionism, to work together. Uh, that was the theme of the speech. Um, but most importantly, he gave us, I think, clear guideposts where we can work together, uh, creating more jobs, um, creating uh, more hope and opportunity for students and for people to get, I love the line about ending unemployment and starting to talk about re-employment. So uh, I was very excited about the speech. Now it's up to us to take action. That's what my constituents expect. That's what I've been hearing from everybody back home. You guys are going to be able to do something, right? So it's about taking action and stop the obstructionism. So I'm with the president. I'm ready to work with anybody. It's a liberal agenda. Can you begin? I don't think there's anything liberal about about America uh, getting back to work. I don't think there's anything liberal about really working to come together to make sure that our technology has uh, the same opportunity as Chinese technology or Japanese technology or German technology in clean energy to compete. I just think that's common sense. And if, if we don't, um, focus and work together. I heard this from businesses just this last week. I met with uh, clean energy companies. Large, small uh, installers, people who need to get on the grid, people who say that we need to improve our grid. Those are all jobs. Minnesota needs to do that. We don't have, we don't have oil. We don't have gas. But what we do have is we have some of the best think tanks, some of the best engineers, some of the best workers in the country. And so he's giving us a chance, I believe, in Minnesota to really shine and to participate in the new economy. I don't think there's anything liberal about competition. Wonderful. Thank you.